Hi Libras, welcome to Cheeky Spiritual Guide. This is going to be your weekly love reading for July 6th through the 12th. Um, it's going to be straight to the point. We're going to see what's going to happen this week and what you should do about it, okay? Um, keep in mind this reading could be for a cross watcher, so don't force it to fit your side. Just take it how it resonates. All right. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Universe Source, what messages do you have for Libras in love? Give them guidance, understanding, wisdom, knowledge, enlightenment, and truth. Truth for healing, freedom, clarity, and peace of mind. What's happening this week for Libra in love? What's happening July 6th through the 12th for Libras in love? All right, four, one more, four more shuffle. There we go. Okay, what's happening this week? Let's see. What's happening for Libra, the Two of Pentacles? Are we juggling? And your advice is the Princess of wands which is also like the page of wands okay underneath that at the bottom is the chariot booyah the chariot that is cancer energy moving forward in a positive direction progressing forward um yeah progression movement moving on all right so you have the two of pentacles Libra, are you juggling this week? What is, why the Two of Pentacles? Okay, Two of Cups with the Nine of Wands. Okay, so you, you could be juggling some type of a connection you're having. Like you're not, you don't feel like this is going to go well. Nine of Wands is like expecting the worst. Nine of Wands. Yeah, there's a very pessimistic um, thought process when it comes to whatever connection this is. Why the Nine of Wands? Okay. Why the Nine of Wands? Like you don't trust it? You don't trust this connection? Kind of do though, but kind of don't. Why the Nine of Wands? Um, yeah, Nine of Wands. Why the Nine of Wands? Why the Nine of Wands? Okay. Why the Nine of Wands? There we go. Um, so the Ace of Wands came out reversed. Ace of Wands in the reverse. Hmm. I don't know. You you could be feeling like you lack some type of determination when it comes to this connection. Why the Ace of Wands reversed? So okay, yeah, lack. Okay, that makes sense. Two of, Two of Pentacles again with the Seven of Wands. I don't think you. You're, you're juggling the idea of, of fighting for this, of standing up for it, standing your ground when it comes to this connection. I think this is you fighting for it. For some reason, you don't feel like it's going to work out. Why the Seven of Wands? Why the Seven of Wands? The Seven of Cups could be confused, could be um, not, you could be a little directionless. Like, I don't really know what to do with this. Okay, indecision, why the Seven of Cups? Okay, Two of Swords in the reverse. Hmm. I think you're you're totally in your head about this connection. Why the two of swords reverse? Wheel of fortune. 
Like, I don't know. It's like you don't think, like you're having trouble feeling like this relationship will come up, will get a start. Like, it, it, like it'll, you have a new opportunity here. Like things will change in your favor. I don't think you think that. What What's the energy of this two of pentacles? The queen of swords. This is, could be you. Could be you. Um, yeah, that might be you. Why the queen of swords? Juggling. Why the queen of swords? The empress. This is a Taurus. Libra card as well. Ouch. Why the Empress? It's almost like, do you think you should cut off somebody? Yeah, I think you're thinking about like, should I just cut this person off? Whatever plans you thought you had or you do have, like cancel them. I feel like that's what you're juggling. Should I just leave them alone? You're thinking about it. You're you're definitely in your head with the Four of Swords. Um, you're in your head, and that's very clear to me. Why why the wheel? Why is the wheel here? Thank you. Three of Cups. I mean, because this person could be involved. Like, there could be third-party energy. Like, another person. Another thing. Why the Three of Cups? Queen of Cups. There could be another person. Like, you may feel like there's another person. Um, Which is why you're juggling. Why the Queen of Cups? Like, you got some competition. Why the Queen of Cups? Whoa. I'll take it. Ooh, you do. Oh my God, Libra. So you just really feel like this is not going to work. I think there's because there is another person involved. I don't see marriage or commitment or, you know, baby daddy, baby mama. I don't see that with this three of cups in reverse. I don't. But I do get there's there's someone else. And this could make you be making you feel some type of way. Make you juggle if I should just cut this person off. Mm -hmm. Feeling defeated here. Feeling like it's not a victory. Let's get your advice. But that's what's happening this week. I feel like you're trying to decide if you should cut someone off. Because you don't think that this relationship will go in your favor. You know what I'm saying? Like it's not going to persevere I guess all right so the your advice is the princess of wands I like the princess of wands because I like the page of wands you know this person is a free spirit they're enthusiastic they love to explore very curious about life and not only only that they have good news to share okay why the princess of wands or that could be a younger fire sign. The Justice card. I want to see what the Princess of Wands, Page of Wands, says on my advice sheet here. Just out of curiosity, what does it say? Page of Wands. Learn more. Be open to any and all learning experiences this card is also advised you to speak up express yourself because he does talk okay the justice why the justice card um and that could be because it feels very much so like speculation like why do you feel this way is there a confirmation is there has something been affirmed um i feel like that's why spirit is saying to be the princess of wands and speak up and say what you feel the justice why the justice card this will create some balance i feel with the with the justice card you know what i mean why the justice because right now you're just juggling you're not in balance because i think you're speculating or you're you're observing a situation and you're not this other person hasn't even said no or yes right so I think you have to speak up, even if they say no, right? It's like, okay, well, good. Now I know for sure. Um, 
Yeah, okay, Justice. Nine of Pentacles, um, with the star. Seven of Swords. Why the Seven of Swords? See, yeah, Libra. <laughs> Libra. I feel like you want to bring harmony, balance into this situation um, with, I think, some, some type of single person. This person is single. Um, I think you, you, you are hopeful, okay? You're hopeful, wishing, hoping, praying even. Um, you're secretly planning something with this. Like, in your mind. I don't think you're doing this out, like, physically. But in your head, you could be planning different ways to bring about this Ten of Pentacles with this person. Ten of Pentacles is, like, just long-term relationship. Something more permanent, right? Moving in a more positive direction. Persevering. Pushing forward. <clears throat> What's the energy of this Princess of Wands? But I think in order to bring about this justice, you might have to just say what it is. You know what I'm saying? Like, hey, this is what I want. This is how I feel. Well, how do you feel? And that way you do bring justice about. Because now it's balanced and you're not juggling in your head, right? Why? why what's the energy of this Princess of Wands? That's how I'm seeing it here. Because um, I do get, some, I feel like something has not been affirmed. Okay, the lovers in the reverse separation this could be like not trusting why the lovers reverse why the lovers reverse the world in reverse <laughs> yeah because it's not moving you you want it to move but it's not moving i don't know like you gotta speak i don't know this is telling you to speak up on this two this lovers in reverse could be either about like you don't trust it or it could be like a fickle situation something you can't really rely on it's stagnant i see that why the knight of swords that's uh oh you whoa hold on why the knight of swords Why the Knight of Swords? Eight of Swords. Feeling stuck. Why the Eight of Swords? Feeling stuck. Feeling powerless. Um, yeah. Oh my goodness. What's the energy of this Knight of Swords? The Queen of Wands. So you want to pursue this person. It's super slow. I think you want to just rush on into this uh, Queen of Wands. <clears throat> you feel stuck though. Like you feel like you can't just have this conversation. I have an Eight of Wands and a Page of Pentacles. There's something here. You're not stuck. I you think you feel like if I say something, it doesn't make a difference. That's what I'm getting. Like this powerless feeling. Like I'll say something, but what is that going to do? Well, the, the point of it is so that you aren't juggling. I think that's the whole advice here is so that you aren't juggling anymore. Like whether this person wants to have something long term with you or not. I think that's a conversation that needs to be had so that you are clear about it. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like you don't trust it. Like you, you just, but, 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 but it's not that it's been confirmed. I just feel like you, you think someone else is in the picture, but like, do you know for sure that's the reason? I don't know. I just, I feel like you should get more clarity. That's what I think the reason why you should speak up, speak your mind, say what it is. All right, guys, that's all I have for you. Good luck with this situation, okay? Mm. Yeah. All right, don't forget to subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you guys next week. Mwah. Deuces.